Yeah, I everything moves. Is quiet. Hey, everybody, we're back here with Wine Reynolds and Rob McElhaney uh, from Welcome to Wrexham. Yeah. How much? How much did this? And how much? How much are we talking? How much did this cost you guys? Well, what happened was it, it, there was a, there was this co this company called Inner Circle Sports, which is in New York City, yeah. and this man named Steve Horowitz who brokered the Liverpool deal, uh, a Yankees purchase, the Red Sox. And I just called him and I said, you've never heard of me, but your sons probably have. He had two, ha two sons. And he said, oh, I'll call you back. And he called me back the next morning, Saturday morning. And he said, um, I'd like to work with you. Wow. And did you tell him about him at that point? Uh, no, I didn't call him until Steve told me how much money it was going to cost. <laughs> OK. Now, how much money? Yeah. How much money does it would it cost if I if I were going to buy a team? How much would it cost? How so much money? Yeah. I, so I I've, I've been very successful. I've been very fortunate. Um, and but I I do work in basic cable late night comedy television. Mm -hmm. So I've got TV money. Sure. Um, I needed uh, movie star money. <clears throat> I needed super superhero money. But you needed what, own my own cell phone company money is well, what you needed. That's, that's, that, that's, that's the, the real, one that's right the there. Right there. It that turns the out right the gin company is worth more than this entire network that, that this show is. <laughs> that this show is. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. Yeah. Oh, okay, so I don't know, do you? Oh, oh yeah. For that. Yeah. yeah. Here's, here's a third here's one. A thank you. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I don't have anything to go with it. Oh, no, no, we don't need anything. That's no, fine. no, you don't need that. That's, that's a, so just, delicious. Just keep talking, Rob. Here, yeah. there you go. Here we go. Cheers. Cheers. Oh. Mm. Oh, that's Ooh, that is that, really... That right. ain't water. That is really tasty. Yeah, that is, it really again, is I'm open. There, there you go. go. Okay, yeah. so let's just say you bought it and it cost millions of dollars, okay? Uh, yeah, well, okay. pounds. Pounds. Yeah, pounds. now remember, pounds are more, more pounds than dollars. Pounds are more than dollars. <laughs> Yeah. Turns out yeah. pounds are heavy. Yeah. yeah. Pounds okay. are heavy. All right. I was, so I was hoping drachmas. You've got yeah. <laughs> or lira. Yeah. So okay. So you got you got uh, you got the team now. What do you then do? How do, when you go to take over a team? Don't you have to get to know the fans? Don't do the fans have to trust you? Don't you have to get to know the people in the town, or else you're these carpetbaggers who come yes. out of nowhere with some funny idea. Let's buy a team. How do you convince them that you're serious about this? Well, we, from the very beginning, we promised, and this is the truth, that we'll always make fun of ourselves, but we'll never make fun of the situation. These mm -hmm. people take this very seriously, as they should. It's the beating mm -hmm. heart of their community. So we knew that if we were going to do something like this, the community would always come first. Mm -hmm. we, we wear our, our hearts on our sleeves, and we do what we say, and we say what we're going to do. We have a clip here of, yes. of, of what this team means to the people in the town. Anything we need to know before we go to it? Yeah, it's just that this is the, the, the heart of what we're trying to do with the show itself, too, which is to, sh to demonstrate that sports isn't just for sporting people. Sports is storytelling, and it's for everybody. And you'll see uh, how these people love, love their club. Jim? In life, everything is just a memory. It, it just disappears. That's why you've got to enjoy them so much when you're in them. I just look at my kids and, like, they're jumping up and down, and I'm, like, holding them in the air. I'll just take them times while I can. That's why I chose a pub like Wrexham, because you want to create memories for other people and have something they can tell their grandkids and their children about. Throws a slings towards the near post. That gives me goosebumps me watching too. it. Yeah, me too. We have to take a break, uh, but stick around. When we come back, I will ask these gentlemen how they are marketing their new Welsh football team. Stick around. 